Thank you. Because I, I used to do this uh, before, oh. before God uh, saved me. Oh wow! Yeah, so I'm 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 very I'm a transformed person now, and that's that's uh, why I because God actually ministered to me to reach out to you, and I know God loves you. Do you have a Christian background? Yes, I do. I I went to church when I was a child. Come on, interesting. I actually have something for you. Uh, what and is it? Uh, I bet you will like it. What uh, is it? It's a gospel track. Have it. Yeah. And I, uh, I just want to ask you something. I don't think oh. I need this. I better be going. Come on, wait, wait. Wait for what? Wait. You don't like, have to go. 
What else do you have to say? Yeah, I I think I'd like to let you know. Um, do you know where uh, someone goes to when one's dying? If, if, if one dies, like, do you have an idea? Well, I don't really think about it that much. I think when I die, I can either go to heaven or I can be reborn. That's just it. Oh. That's um, interesting. That's quite good because I'm um, kind of um, very happy that you have a clue to where you're okay. kind of where you kind of go to, either heaven or hell. And um, this one is so cute. The service is at Jessica. Mm, the service is okay. What do you think? I thought it was good, you know. The pastor really emphasized the importance of our hearts and serving God and, you know, what we have to do. Sister Jessica, the Spirit of God is, is telling me to witness to that lady over there. What do you think? Oh, God. Oh, we just came from church. I'm tired. No. But that's what the Spirit of God is asking me. I should tell her about God. <laughs> That's not the spirit of God. <laughs> Look at the girl. She's clearly like. She, is she complaining that she doesn't like the life she's living? Well, we are called to be ambassadors of God. We're called to witness to people. That's why we are here. I think you're beginning to take Pastor Soaring a little bit too serious. Don't you think so? Isn't it true that they said that? <laughs> Darkness, light should not be yoked together. Why do you want to go minister to her? Did she ask you she doesn't like her life? She looks fine. Why do you why are you pressing the issue? Sister Jessica, you are twisting the scripture. We are called to be a city on a hill that cannot be hidden. A light in this dark world. If we don't spread the light of the gospel, then how are they supposed to know the truth? She cannot be saved. She can't. She can't. Look yes. at her. Oh my just gosh, just look Jessica. at her like Look how she's dressed, like she's smoking, and then she's always around this church asking for something. Does she look like someone that can be saved? Honestly, no, seriously, like ask yourself. Does this look like someone that is going to be in heaven with us? No, is the answer no. So Somebody witnessed to us, and it was because of the seed of the gospel that they sowed in our <laughs> hearts that we were able to come to the light of the truth of the gospel of Jesus Christ. I'm sorry. We're supposed to do the same thing by sowing that seed in the lives of people like her. Seed? Is she a garden? You only plant seed when you know for certain the soil is fertile. She's not fertile at all. She's for the streets, girl. Just get over it. Move on. Why do you always want to talk to random? Let's, let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Can I have five bucks, please? I want to buy food. Do we look like the ATM to you? You need to go and work. I'm hungry. You need to work. What Wait, are you doing? Wait, help her. Let's give her. She's hungry. You want to give her the money? Yeah. <laughs> You're not serious. You want to. Come on. For what? No. Go and work. Are you not the one coming from the church? The Bible says that don't follow people to do evil. You're going to give her this money. Look at her. Smoking. Drinking. She even had money to get tattoos. She don't need your money. Here. Don't give her nothing. No. But I'm helping her. Really? So next week when she comes again with new cigarettes and new tattoos, that was your money that helped her do that. Is that what you're supposed to do? Child of God, don't give her nothing. You need to work and stop begging. You're always begging. Just begging. Ah, please, let's go. Why do you always want to give me more news? I thought the way you're supposed to do it. believe what I just saw okay so remember that hooker I told you about the one that lives right next to my house I just saw her walk into her apartment with your husband like seriously listen first of all girl you need to get tested because I see that girl with different men every single day and 
I need you to come here right now because you need to teach her a lesson. Yeah, just call me when you get here, okay? UPS? I'm not expecting a package though. UPS? UPS? I'm not expecting a package though. Yeah, it's UPS. Ta da! What? Are you shocked? Are you shocked? Who are you? You've been sleeping with my husband. He is a married. Married. Do you see this ring? He's a married. Who's your husband anyway? Oh! <laughs> so you don't even know all the husbands you've been sleeping around in this town with? You don't know? Are you are you are you speechless? Are you speechless? Say something! Who is your husband? Like, oh I'm please! Kidding. What? Where's my phone? Methodist? Hi, I am. Are you okay? You're crying. I'll be alright. I don't know what you're going through, but I just want to let you know that Jesus loves you. Are you kidding me? He doesn't love me. He does. He doesn't love me. He doesn't love me. Why would you say that? Where was he when my mom died? Where was he when my dad died? Where was he when my homie died last night? What are you talking about? What friend are you talking about? Was it the friend I saw you the other day? Oh my God. Do you mind if I see it? Whatever. Oh, the message is God still loves you. He will forgive you. And your sins won't be remembered anymore. Surrender to him today. That's it is. He does love you. He does. He does. How did I even get here? I wasn't like this. I used to go to church. I was born in church. My name is Grace. <laughs> I've been hurt for so long. <laughs> oh, will God forgive me? 
I've done a couple of bad things. <laughs> I'm a thief. <laughs> I was. <laughs> I don't even know how I got into this. <laughs> how did I even get myself into this? No. <laughs> I've done a couple of abortions. <laughs> Will they forgive me? <laughs> you know, um, when I used to go to church back then, the other time the pastor said, <laughs> Our fornicators will go to hell, you know. That was a long time ago. And I don't think he'll forgive me. I've broken a lot of homes. <laughs> I've given up on life already. Because <laughs> I don't have anything to live for. <laughs> <laughs> oh Lord, oh God, I'm sorry. <laughs> Are you sure? Don't oh, forgive me. <laughs> you know, as I said, I was born in church. You know my friend, right? Yeah. He was the only one I had. <laughs> what do I need to do for God to forgive me? The Bible tells us that God caused the world because of Adam's sin. Once sin came to the world, death and misery came with it. Coming kingdom, there will be no more sin, pain and death. No one fights with God and winning. Even if you are tempted, you will succeed. It doesn't matter what you've done. God will still forgive you. Are you sure God will forgive me? Yes, He will. <laughs> what else do I need to do? You only need to repent and forsake your sins. Then read the Bible daily and attend the Bible believing church. I'm ready. I'm ready. I'm ready to surrender. Do you mind if I hold your hands up there with you? I don't mind. <laughs> Please say this prayer as a father. Father, I come to you today. Father, I come to you today. Confessing my sins. Confessing my sins and asking for your forgiveness and asking for your forgiveness. I confess with my mouth and my heart. I confess with my mouth and believe in my heart. Please begin to confess your sins. Father, I ask that you forgive me for all these iniquities. Father, I ask that you forgive me for all these iniquities and let your Holy Spirit come into me. And let your Holy Spirit come into me. Cleanse me completely, Lord. Cleanse me completely, Lord. In Jesus' name we pray. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen.